Hi, I thought I'd do a quick video on debadging a Volkswagen Atlas. I've been reading a lot on the internet and watching videos of people that are using products like Goo Gone to get these um, little emblems off the car. And uh, I found this product by 3M. It's called the 3M Eraser Tool. You can see that there. And uh, it's absolutely amazing. So I thought I'd post this quick video and hopefully help other people that are doing the same thing. I didn't like the Atlas on the back here. I wanted to remove it. I'm thinking about removing the other decals, but for now I'm working on Atlas. So what I'm gonna do is show you how to remove the letter and then show you the eraser tool. All right, here we go. So using a heat gun, I'm gonna heat it up. I'm on low setting and I just slowly heat the letter up. Not too close because I don't want to melt any of the plastic. And I use my finger here to kind of feel the temperature so it's not getting too hot. So just taking my time. Heating it up and it's already really hot out so it's kind of soft to start with. If it was really cold you might have to do this a little bit longer. This way I'm not you know, burning my hand. I'm just making sure it's not getting too hot because I don't want to melt any of this plastic that's on here. And once it gets softened up, I'm going to take a little piece of fishing line. And you just start scissoring it off. Boom! Comes right off. So, there it is right there. Save that in case I need to put it on if I'm ever resell the vehicle. And here's your eraser tool. I'm on medium setting on my DeWalt drill. What I've been doing is just taking a little bit off and then using a the towel seeing about where I'm at. Pretty much almost done. Get the resume in here. Let's not hurt the plastic. It's an amazing little tool. And it'll save you a ton of time. Now I'm just taking this soft cloth, just kind of buffing out a little bit of the adhesive and it just kind of just comes right off. It is that easy. Absolutely amazing. Debadging Volkswagen Atlas. Okay, so I wanted to add a little bit to the first video. Um, I did the Atlas that's on the chrome strip here, and it came out just beautiful. There's no bar burr marks on it. There's just nothing wrong with it whatsoever. It's just shiny, and it was very quick to get off. So I thought what I'd do is just go ahead and show how to remove these two. We'll use the eraser tool again, and we'll, we'll see how it works on actual paint. So I'm gonna heat it up. Again. You can see how the letters just it's just soft and it just just immediately starts coming off. Back in here. The E. There it comes. I'm going to go ahead and grab the eraser tool. I've been kind of running it at low speed so it doesn't get too hot. Maybe like burn the paint, but you can kind of feel it's taking the emblem off. Now we'll go ahead and hit it with the cloth. As you can see already, almost all the adhesive is almost gone. Hit it one more time. I think that might do it. 
using this nice soft cloth. And notice on the chrome, if I just kind of just rubbed it, it just comes pretty much right off. I mean, it's just an amazing tool. So much better than using Goo Gone. It takes forever on some of the videos I've seen. So look at that. I don't even know if I'm even going to have to buff this or wax it. It's so nice and shiny. And I'll move the camera up close. Sorry about that. I'm new to doing videos. Got it on this tripod here. But there it is up close. And it is literally gone. Hi, I just wanted to add a disclaimer to the video. I was talking with my son. He said it would probably be a good idea to do a disclaimer. Um, I just want everybody to know that this is just my own personal vehicle and I'm not being paid by 3M, um, by their racial tool product or any of that. Um, I bought it myself out of my own money, and I'm just showing people how amazing the tool is. Uh, so I just wanted to just do a little disclaimer to make sure that my video doesn't get taken off of YouTube. All right, so uh, here's the Atlas, completely debadged. I decided to do the uh, all the uh, emblems on the back, and I think it came out really nice. I, I really like the the look of it. It's really clean now. It gives it a super nice streamlined look. Uh, it has a real Germanic kind of Audi-esque look to it, and uh, it's nice. So, yeah, the 3M racer tool is amazing. I probably could have done the complete debadging in probably a half hour, 45 minutes. I mean, it's that easy to remove the glue the adhesive glue that stays after you remove the emblems so hope people will like this video and uh, maybe you'll be doing this to one of your vehicles soon it gives it a nice clean look